Hi, Dr. Gina Winger here, Chair of the Department of Art and Sign at Minnesota State University, Mankato. The faculty, staff, and I are so excited to meet you, and we can't wait to see the amazing things you'll do. The art and design programs offer many different options for you as you find your creative path. Whether it is graphic design, painting, ceramics, printmaking, photography, drawing, installation, sculpture, art history, or art teaching. Once you arrive on campus, we can talk more about whether you want to follow the Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Fine Arts, or the Bachelor of Science and Teaching paths. All of the paths start with the same classes and will help you connect with your fellow art majors and minors. Don't forget to get involved. There are so many different clubs and activities in the Department of Art and Design. Our clubs include the Ceramics Club, called Mudworks, the Sculpture Club, Fashion Photography, our Printmaking Club, called Works on Paper, the American Institute of Graphic Arts, or AIGA, and the Student Art League. To welcome you to the department, some of our current students want to share their experiences with you too. Let's hear what they had to say. Hi, my name is Annie and I'm a senior in the art department. My advice to new students and to incoming freshmen is to follow your dreams and to reach out if you're ever feeling lost. Advisors, other professors, fellow classmates, we're all here to support you. My name is Selena, I'm a senior ceramics major and some advice that I would give to incoming freshmen or transfer students would to create routines now that have to do with your homework, your studying, and your self-care because you want to create a balanced life between all three. What I would tell my younger self is to be brave and ask questions and don't be afraid. To try new things and be reckless and don't be afraid of the outcome. As a new student at MSU, get to know the resources that are available to you through the school. That includes things like facilities such as the student rock climbing wall, as well as electronics and equipment rentals available to you through the library, and many other services like health services, counseling appointments, psychologists, and many, many other resources that are available to you already through the school that can be a great help to you throughout your college career. So being involved in clubs and the community is important for everyone. They provide you opportunities that you might not get otherwise. You get different activities to do, different places to go. They also have a lot of good networking opportunities to meet more people for your future career. And then you can also meet really great people that might just become your best friends. One of the greatest opportunities you can have throughout your college career is a study abroad experience. Studying abroad gives you the opportunity to experience new cultures, see amazing sights, and take classes that may not be available to you through MSU. And regardless of your situation, if you're interested, look into these programs, because you never know what kinds of resources or funding are available to make these experiences possible for you. One of the most impactful parts of my education has been uh, feedback from others, whether it's other students or professors, visiting artists, but taking notes on that too and putting it down in my sketchbook. Maintaining and keeping a sketchbook uh, not to the point of finishing it, but really just getting through it, getting on to the next one, just getting those ideas down frees up my mind to continue working and developing new ideas. No matter the department and no matter the time, there are always professors that care about your individual growth. This came in several different forms from the different kinds of critiques and all the extra time spent and all of the resources that they helped me gather without second-guessing or prompting. You're good enough. You're good enough to follow whatever dreams you have and passions that excite you. You will excel at it. You will make a future out of it, so long as you keep the passion. Hey, incoming art students. Uh, my name is Ellen Schofield. I'm a professor of graphic design. I teach digital media, um, concept and image and motion graphics and I'm really looking forward to getting to work with each of you. Hi incoming students, uh, welcome to the Graph Design uh, program at Minnesota State Mankato. My name is Matt Willemson, I'm a professor at Graph Design and I teach Graph Design 1, 2, and 3. And some of the things that you might be able to learn from my classes are things about symbols, brand identity, preparing designs for print production and uh, portfolio preparation. Uh, looking forward to having you in class and um, have a great, great semester. Hello, incoming art students. My name is Brad Coulter. I'm a professor in the graphic design area in the Department of Art and Design, and I teach all levels of typography. 
Um, that would include everything from layouts to typographic treatments for logos and brand identity to long documents, book design, magazine design, and zine design. We're really excited to have you joining us this, this fall and can't wait to be part of your journey towards your degree and your future in art and design. Hi there, I'm Stacia Service. I will be teaching Web Design 1. Um, so we'll cover off on kind of all things web and interactive. So user interface, UX, um, responsive design, maybe dabble in a little bit of coding if we're feeling <laughs> lucky. Um, but I'm really excited to get to know you all and, and to work with you. Hi, my name is Kelly Munson, and I just want to welcome you all. Uh, I'll be teaching Typography 1 and 2, and I look forward to seeing you and sharing my love of design and typography with you. See you soon, new students. My experience at MNSU, hard to sum up, but I would say that it really ignited my potential. I went in the program hungry and the professors fed me. Uh, my curiosity was a little flicker and they dumped gasoline on it. Uh, gave me guidance, resources, inspiration, instruction, feedback, and really nourished me as a creative. Uh, it's had this ripple effect on my life and it's a huge part of the success I've had in my career. Now, please don't think that this video is the only way of contacting us if you have any questions. If you go to the MNSU Art and Design website, you can find all the faculty emails as well as websites. If you have any questions that you'd like to ask me, you'll see me in orientation and you can also email me. My email is my name. Gina.wenger at mnsu.edu. That's G I N A dot W E N G E R at mnsu.edu. All right, you have a good summer and I'll see you soon. Bye bye.